in the last video I did the effect similar to the one you just seen and I got a couple of questions in DMs how I did it so I'm gonna make a tutorial about it today let's get it started okay so let's get into the laptop and I'm gonna show you how to do this so we're gonna do that on the intro from this video I'm gonna mute the audio so you don't hear it uh, when I speak and we're gonna get to the point where we wanna make a zoom uh, so we're gonna uh, go to retime curve uh, by right clicking and selecting it from the menu and we are gonna select deselect the retime frame here and we're gonna select the zoom uh, zoom X or zoom Y is good because uh, it's linked together so we don't need to worry about which one we're gonna be using and basically what we want to do is zoom into that timeline over here and we can option click and uh, add point where we want to start the zooming and add the point where we want to end the zooming like this or you can do it right here you can select where the zoom will end and press the keyframe over here and we want to zoom it in for example to 1 200 and as you can see there is a zoom happening now. But what we want to do now, and what we're going to need the retime curve here, uh, or a zoom X curve, uh, let's say, uh, we want to make it smoother. So it's not just a zoom, it's a smooth zoom. It speeds up and slows down. So if we want to speed up at the beginning, we want to press that button over here so we can zoom it in uh, with the speed and you can see it's speeding up when we zoom it in and now you can do the same when it stops so you can see you have this ramp over here and if you play it you can see that this zoom is much smoother And we can make it even smoother by just grabbing that dot over here and grabbing that over here and it's going to be even smoother and it's going to be quicker as well. So if we want to do that, you can just do that or do that and it's going to be even smoother. But make sure it looks nice uh, and it, you don't really play too much with these uh, dots over here. Yeah, I made it look quite weird so I'm just gonna uh, take it back and as you can see that looks pretty good so we zoomed in now so we want to zoom out let's say over here we're gonna option and click on that uh, line over here and option and click on that line over here and we're gonna zoom out we can drag that down to one and we can do the same we can do this to make a ramp over here and we can do this to make a ramp over here so now if I play it back to you you have a smooth zoom in and you have a smooth zoom out so this is how you do it guys so hopefully that tutorial was helpful for you guys. If you want to find out anything else from DaVinci Resolve, let me know in the comments. I'm very happy to hear your suggestions for videos and I'm really happy to do more of the tutorials like this. Uh, if you liked it, leave it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and ring the bell. That helps a lot. Uh, so thank you very much if you do that. And you can also check out my Instagram. I post uh, there daily. I try to post there daily. I post reels, I post photos, uh, stories, etc. So if you want to keep up with me, the Instagram is the best place to do that. And I think this is everything for this video. So I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye.